Hi there, Kent Larson from Tang Bit Repair Guide. So the Masterson 360 high pressure. Um, I actually would recommend this uh, this machine. Um, a couple of things that you need to think about is that Sportredo left uh, the U.S. a couple of years ago. Uh, whatever it was left, uh, they left to PC marketing, uh, which is great at handling the equipment, uh, no doubt about that. Um, however, you could certainly be unlucky to find yourself in a bit of a pickle with a piece of decor or something like that. Just so you know, if one is like really smashed up somewhere, don't expect that to be all ironed out for you. Uh, that all the stuff is available and, and so forth. You might have to go really alternative with uh, having something made or putting something together to to kind of patch it together if there's some kind of damage on it, which there could easily be if you have it shipped. Um, you know, here it's really important to have a, a, a tech uh, wrap it up for you because uh, this this could easily uh, this this kind of machine has has a has a lot of things that could tweak uh, and break uh, during transportation. Um, the filter glass would be my uh, thing here to to really keep an eye on. Inspect those frequently. They are ultra thin they have like these uh, creases in it they can easily crack and let through uvc so that's pretty bad actually i mean that that could cause um they're very very small uh, they will make very very small c uh, creases but you see these these creases uh, could let out uvc uh, maybe not so much but some however and um, the safety system will not shut it off. So um, uh, there's a lot of pieces to this one. Uh, when you take it apart, uh, you have to really do it in the order that the manual is, dic is dictating. So um, I really urge you to, we have the uh, Masterson 360 manual on our website to have that downloaded and uh, print it out or on a laptop so that you're able to follow those instructions on the day of install. Um, the fans in it, um, I have uh, been in a situation of needing those a couple of times. Uh, was able to find them uh, as a uh, regular uh, electrical part at a, at a reasonable price. So uh, just so you know. Uh, it is possible to find uh, some of the electrical components on this machine uh, out there uh, and not through the tanning industry. This is it uh, for uh, for me here on the Masterson 360. Please comment below if uh, you have some kind of question. I've seen quite a few of these. Uh, people are generally very happy about uh, owning this piece of equipment. Thank you for watching. Bye.